Hey guys, so I'm going to come to you real fast and just do a quick um, day old hair tutorial. Um, this hair was slept on last night, um, hasn't been washed today, looks like kinky and kind of icky because I um, have a shower today, obviously. This is like a quick um, try and get out of the house, last minute kind of hair, hair day. Thing. Um, so what I like to use if I don't have a chance to shower, I like to grab some dry shampoo. Um, I don't know whoop, if you can see. This is the kind that I use. I got it on a really good deal. I'm a couponer, and so um, I got a bunch of bottles for like close to free. So anyway, um, I just spray some of this. Just you no, know, of course it's out. That's fine. Let's see if I can make it work. Oh, there it goes. Um, I just spray some really quick, like, and then just kind of rub it around. It smells delightfully delicious. Oh, it smells so good. And so then I just kind of like rub it in, brush it through, because you don't want that icky dry shampoo look. <laughs> Even though it is cleaning your hair just a little bit, soaking up some of that oil. Um, I'm retarded about how the how the computer works here. The screen works. It's like backwards for me. Anyway, um, so I've just got my hair like parted on the side. Usually I have like a pretty legit swoopy bang, um, but obviously my hair was pulled back, so I'm not gonna worry about that. Um, I'm just gonna do like a double braid. Not hard, but something that I think that a lot of people forget about. But we don't have to make it like a pippy long stocking pigtail braid, you know what I mean? Um, just can make a cute braid, cute couple braids. So you just need two little teeny clear elastics um, and you're just going to part it in the back and then we're going to just over the top of your ear, keep that top of the hair over the top of your ear and just braid down. This works on short or long hair, obviously my hair is not super long. So I'm just gonna braid down as far as I can go. Keeping this hair over my ear. And then I'm just going to tie it off with the elastic. I'm just gonna leave it like that for a second and grab another elastic. So I'm gonna grab this hair from the other side. The part doesn't matter if it's exactly perfect. Um, the side part looks pretty cute if it's kind of perfect, but the back part, it doesn't matter so much. Separated into three. And remember to keep this hair over at, at the top, over the top of your ear. So we don't want it like parted behind the ear, slicked back, you know, straight school girl, you know, 12 year old kind of look. That's not really what we're going for here. Just braid it down. Tie it off. Now here's what you do to make this not so, oh, I'm 12 years old and I go to school, you know. Um, just take your braid and pull. Pull at the top, pull at the bottom, tighten that up right there and it kind of fluffs up your braid. Puff your hair up right here. Do the same on the other side. Loosen that braid. Pull. Fluff. Do what you gotta do. Make it fluffy. If you have curly or wavy hair that like curls up in the rain, or you can like scrunch it, oh, perfect hair for this. Um, this one I think needs just a little more fluffy. You gotta make them even, you know, kind of play with them. You'll see what I mean when you start doing it. Um, and then if you want to fix your ends to make sure that they're like folding in instead of flinging out like a wild hair. Um, and then if you want, you can like, you can, you know, grab some bobby pins, pin this part back. Um, if you want, you don't really have to. You can just let it fall, let it hang. Um, I like to let mine down a little bit in the front. Just let those pieces come out and do their natural thing. Um, you can run some hairspray through it. Just keep, you will just, you'll mess with it. You'll fluff it all day long. Um, you have to keep puffing it out of your face. This is a really cute look with like a slouch beanie. Um, 
that's good too. Um, really cute that way. Or like to the side, like kind of beret type thing. Or even like a baseball hat. This is like a good hat hair day. Or it's super cute without with a scarf, like a chunky scarf. Um, speaking of chunky, chunky scarves or slouchy beanies, you can get those. I found some really cute ones um, in the link below. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, sloppy hair day old hair tutorial i'll be back for more so make sure that you click subscribe and like and share my videos and um yeah i'll be back with more tutorials bye